Welcome to the Adventures of the Oklahoma Grunt Man. Hope you're having a beautiful day. Uh, day before Thanksgiving, I've been just on the go all day today. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I don't know what my video is going to consist of today. It might be uh, pretty short. I got, I've been baking pies this morning. Uh, my friend uh, Tressie from the farmer's market brought me over a whole bunch of raspberries so I've been bagging them up and finding a place to put them in the freezer uh, I'm going to be making some jelly or jam uh, I'm going to make some regular raspberry and some raspberry pepper jam with habaneros and jalapenos. Uh, I got to go to Walmart and get some more jars and some more sugar. I got a, I got a lot of strawberries to use, or raspberries to use up. Blooper! <laughs> but, uh, I... I need to go to Walmart and get that sugar and and uh, jars. I got plenty of the uh, sure gel or pectin. I don't remember who sent it to me. I believe it was Teresa Green, but I'm not positive. I think it was. Sent me a whole bag of pectin, so I'm good on that. I'll finally get to use it. Uh, I've been meaning to use it all summer, but I just didn't have it in me to make jelly and jam when it was 100 degrees outside. But yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful Thanksgiving. Uh, I'm sorry if the video is kind of short today, but uh, I'll get you what I can. Uh, I might bring you along with doing some of the canning process of uh, the raspberry jam. Uh, I'll uh, show you some of that. I probably won't do it all, but I wish it would have stayed cool out. It, it actually warmed up really nice today, but it would have been nice if it would have been a little cooler with the bacon and and if I gotta get the hot water bath on, my house is gonna be really warm, which is fine. It's been cooling off at night, but uh, if I have to, I'll just open a window up and, and get that done. But it's gonna be a, a busy evening. I've been on, really on the go all day. Uh, I started baking pies this morning. I uh, thought I was all done with that, and Tressie called me up and said, you want some raspberries? And with the price of raspberries, I could not say no. Uh, this is going to save me a ton of money making my preserves. But I just had to, I froze a bunch of them. Uh, I think I ended up with 18 flats of raspberries and two flats of blueberries. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I had to freeze a bunch of them and make room in my freezer. Uh, yeah, that was the worst part, making room. Uh, I threw a bunch of old stuff away that was in my freezer that been in there for a long time. 
so but anyway we'll see what we can do for getting the video out today uh, please like share subscribe comment uh, smash that notification bell for me And, yeah, well, like I said, I'll see what I can get done for a video. And if not, we'll get something better tomorrow on Thanksgiving. So, if I don't get anything else out yet today, have a blessed and happy Thanksgiving. Don't eat too much turkey. Uh, God bless you guys. I love you. And we'll talk to you later.
Hey everybody, I got a double batch of raspberry habanero jam getting ready to go here. Uh, I got to bring it to a boil here and then add the sugar. Then bring it back up to another boil for 30 minutes and then jar it up. And get it in the water bath. And we'll get this first batch out of the way tonight. It's a, actually a double batch. I doubled everything up, so I'm going to get two batches out of it. So, just wanted to give you guys an update. Talk to you later. God bless. Hey everybody, I got the sugar added in. Now I got to bring it back up to a rolling boil for three minutes. And then I can jar it up and get it in the water bath. I'll show you when I have it all jarred up and ready to go. Talk to you later. God bless. Hey everybody, I got seven jars, seven pint jars full of the raspberry habanero jam. Uh, got that out of the way and the next few days I'll be busy making a lot of jam because I got a lot of raspberries to use. So I just wanted to bring you along with that. God bless you. We'll talk to you later. Hey everybody, I hope you had a very, very good Wednesday, uh, Thanksgiving Eve, if you want to call it that. Uh, sorry my video isn't very much today, but I have been on the go since I got up this morning and uh, didn't get a whole lot videoed. <laughs> uh, tomorrow I'm going over to Tristan's. We're gonna I'm going to celebrate Thanksgiving over there with... Dawn, Chris, and the family. Uh, she's got the turkey over there. I, I brought the turkey over, oh, three or four weeks ago. She had it in the freezer. Uh, I got pies here to bring it and bread tomorrow. Uh, I've been doing raspberries, as you guys have seen. Uh, but I just hope the Lord blesses you with a wonderful Thanksgiving tomorrow. Uh, if you're spending time with family, cherish that time uh, as long as you can. Uh, if you're spending it with friends, I hope you just have a wonderful holiday. Happy Thanksgiving. Don't eat too much turkey. Uh, I don't know if you guys watch football. I, I don't watch football. But the traditional Cowboys and the and the Lions will be playing tomorrow, I'm sure. Uh, and there's usually parades on in the morning. But but anyway, I'm going to get my video uploaded. Like I say, it's not much today. Uh, I'm sorry about that. But I just really didn't have time to video today. And Tristan was busy helping his mom get stuff ready for tomorrow. So, yeah, it... The day before Thanksgiving, and I've been on the run. But anyway, I love you guys. Uh, tomorrow we'll get you some of our Thanksgiving festivities over to Tristan's house. Uh, but you guys have a wonderful Thanksgiving tomorrow. God bless you guys. And like I always say, treat everybody the way you want to be treated and make this world a better place. Keep moving towards your goals and do something nice for somebody. God bless you guys. I love you. And we'll talk to you tomorrow on Turkey Day. God bless you guys.